Hey y'all, so I'm back. I'm over here at the trailer. I'm about to show y'all got a new tripod. Another tripod. I said another. I had so many tripods to shine. Like this is really it's really crazy. So I think I already had this one before. I went ahead and bought this one again. One of the main reasons I um I went on here and bought another one is because I needed this part to hold my phone since that's what I'm gonna probably be recording from for a little minute. Um y'all don't know this, but I sent my okay, I had two cameras, right? I got oh I had two cameras, I still got one, I still got the um Canon G7X Marks 2. I still got that one. I sent the sunny back. The sunny, I just I just wasn't feeling it. I me personally, I don't like it. I never did like it because I felt like the lighting on it to be that much to you know to pay paying that much money for it. I feel like the lighting will never go just or get right to where I needed it to be. Like let's just say if I was like in the dark. Like, like for instance, the room that I, I live in right now in my grandmother's house, that room, it always show up like dark, like, and I didn't like this. So I, I don't know if I needed to play with it a little bit more or what, but I went ahead and sent that one back. I, I just, I didn't want it anymore. So I don't have that camera anymore. I got the, um, I still have my Canon. This is my tripod, y'all. It's just a little regular tripod. I'll leave the link down. Just a little regular old tripod, but it's real tall. I always want I want a tall one. So y'all can look like y'all looking up at me, some type of whatever I'm trying to say here. Yep. So yeah, I done had this one before. See like no, this ain't the one I thought. Maybe it is. I don't know. But yeah, I just wanted this part. I needed this part. I still have my old tripod, but it's bigger than this. I just went ahead and ordered a new one, though. Let's see what this for. I don't know. I went ahead and ordered a new one because I just didn't feel like looking for no part. <laughs> I didn't feel like looking for no part. And then if I had to look for a part, it probably was going to be at the trailer because it's where my tripod is at. And I see that my kids have been milling it while I wasn't there, so I ain't got time. So let me transfer you out to the tripod. Hey everybody, it's me. I'm back. I'm just playing. I am back though. I'm just gonna show y'all. Um well I can't really show y'all, but this is my fantasy that will be going in the bathroom. I'm you know, right now my um stepdad is doing the work in my bathroom in my bathroom that i'll be having he's doing the work in there fixing the floor as y'all can see i don't know if y'all saw it good or not but um the floor didn't even have real wood on it it's some kind of other stuff so he's replacing it with um plywood somebody said something about i was putting rug over the floor and then and it was molded. I don't know where the whole molded part come from, but uh we don't have mold. <laughs> That's crazy. Um when I saw it, I was laughing. I was like, now did I say that? Because I don't think I ever mentioned having mold in the trailer. Because I mean, I never seen no mold. What are you talking mold at? So you gotta inform me on that one. But anyways, he's picking it up because it was um the floor had a damaged, it had a damaged spot. Right where the toilet was, and I think maybe it's because it probably had got wet. Like I said, it's not real plywood, so he um ended up replacing it for me. He's doing it right now. The toilet will be going back in, but I will re be replacing the vanity and the vanity top, the mirror, probably the light, and I'm getting a new faucet. So um I eventually want to change the faucet things for the tub also. But I think I'm gonna just wait for right now. You ain't gonna be able to see it anyway. I'm gonna have a shower curtain over it anyways. But I want everything in matte black. So 
that's how I'm going with it. I have this vision in my head that I want to try to bring to life. I'm putting wallpaper in there, of course. Y'all know I love me some good wallpaper. So, um, yeah, I did make an Amazon wish list. So, if y'all want to just go over there and check that out. I know a lot of people were telling me to make one. I was kind of indecisive because I was like, maybe they, you know, I might be doing too much. I just did all this moving. You know, they ain't going to want to buy no more stuff, which is fine. You know, it's totally fine. I have... Nothing but time to get stuff that I need. I'm not really in a rush. But, you know, if y'all want to come in and help us out a little bit, I did add some stuff in the Amazon wish list. And I added, like, cleaning stuff. You know, a little stuff around the house. Um, the organizing stuff like that. Stuff, just little, little minor stuff. I did add the air fryer back in that y'all, somebody had bought for me when I was in the apartment. Now, the reason I did that is because the air fryer that y'all got for me, the Ninja Air Fryer, um, I loved it. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. But when my kids moved in with my mom, she needed an air fryer. So, I wasn't using it. It was still at the trailer. So, um, I went ahead and gave her that one. Now, I don't want to take it back from my mama. So, I just added it back on there because eventually I am going to get another air fryer. So, I just wanted to go in and say that part. But yeah, we need like curtains, rods. I'm gonna eventually change out the light fixtures and all the good stuff. I'm going back and forth, depending on when the time, how much time is winding down before Christmas, I might go ahead and paint the walls in the living room. That's what I've been thinking about doing. But as far as everything else, I'm just gonna wait. I'm not gonna try to put too much on myself because I wanna do Christmas at this house. I wanna be in the house for Christmas, that's the plan. And I want my kids to wake up and just be at their own house, opening their gifts and stuff like that. Because this Christmas, they are going to be really blessed. I'm so very thankful for just being able to have the health and strength to be able to get up, go to work, and do what I got to do, you know, for my kids, for our little family. I'm just, I'm just so grateful, y'all. You know, it was times where we couldn't hardly get anything for them. And then it's times where we, we were truly blessed and we, we could get stuff for them. My kids, they don't really, I mean, they not really, they not, what kind of word I'm using for? They are very appreciative of everything that we do for them. So if we do have like a little, you know, we just tell them, you know, Santa Claus couldn't get this, Santa Claus couldn't get that. They be appreciative of, you know, the things that they do get. So, um, yeah. I'm not gonna say I, I I don't I don't know. Somebody said you know I have all this money. I don't know where that part come from either. I work hard to get with the, you know the things that I want. And um, it was a time in my life where I just could not manage money well. So now that I am older, a little bit older, not that much older, just a little bit older, and I um learn to appreciate stuff more. I feel like I can manage my money builder and just kind of plan out stuff and just, I, you know, stuff like this. So when it's time to put the Christmas tree up, of course, I'm putting on my same tree, seven and a half foot uh, pre-lit. I had got from Walmart. It was like $99. I think this is going to be my second year putting it up. Yeah. Third year. Yeah, this is going to be the third year we're putting it up. I'm going to let the kids decorate it. We're going to probably use our same decorations. I may or may not get like a bag of ornaments, you know, a new bag of ornaments or two. I don't know. Yeah, we do. We're not going to be much. But I already have decorations for Christmas. So whatever I have, I'm just going to reuse it because, like I said, the time is winding down. I really won't even have that much time. We'll probably leave our tree up a little bit after Christmas since we won't really have that much time with it. Since we still trying to get stuff done, but I hope and pray that we be able to be in the trailer. But if not, you know, it's going to be okay. We're going to be okay. We're working on it. We are working on it. So, yeah, like I said, it's the vanity over there. I can't wait to show you all. I'm not going to show y'all no picture. I want to show y'all it, when it's finally in and installed and stuff like that. So, I'm not going to show y'all no picture. I'm going to keep y'all in suspense. And let y'all see it when it's finally done. Um, I think this is going to be on the vlog channel. And then when I get ready to start cleaning, I'm going to have that on the cleaning channel. I think I'm going to insert a little bit of the clips of my stepdad working in there. And then I'm going to break it up some kind of way. Because I want to have some footage for the cleaning channel and then some for this channel. So, 
I'm just so excited, y'all. Thank y'all so, so much for the comments. I've just been reading them and just smiling like y'all so nice. I had about three or four negative ones. But y'all know what I do with them. Blocked. I don't got time for that. So, um, thank y'all so much. I just, y'all make my heart smile. Like, to say that I, I you know, y'all admire me. You know, I'm so strong and stuff like that. <sighs> It takes a lot to be strong. I'm trying to tell y'all, it takes a lot to be strong. But me, if you know me personally, which a lot of you um, are new and probably don't know me, you know, from being here, if you go back and watch, you'll see. Because I, I mean, I'm the same person. I don't change. But I'm just a positive person. I'm, I'm not a negative person at all. Now, what I will do, I am very playful. But negative, I'm not. And I don't even want that on my channel. So. If I happen to see any kind of negativity, I just go ahead and block it. I really don't even try to indulge in it anymore. It was a time where I was like, you know, I'm going to go back and say something and stuff like that. But these days, I ain't even worried about it. Um, I'm trying to touch bases with a few things. I read some of the comments and I was going to come in, but something happened. And I just don't want to start coming in the middle of our comments and then like skip all over people and stuff like that. Because I feel like that's rude. So when I get time... To like sit down and actually come in back to people. I'm going to come in back. But I did see somebody ask. I think a couple people asked. If the land we are on. Do I have to rent it? And I just want to tell y'all. This house is paid for. The land is. is I'm going to say it's mine. It's actually for my grandfather. Y'all remember my grandfather? My um, grandma and my grandfather. This is all their land. We just out here in just acres and acres and acres of land. So my mom is beside us. Um, well, she's all around us. My mom is in front of me. She's walking distance. My brother, my grandmother. So I'm just in the back, just chilling back here. So no, I do not have to rent any land. This land is owned and, you know, paid for and all that stuff being paid for. Um, it's, you know, the, the area is pretty big. I feel like it's a nice size for my kids to get out and play. And then my mom, you know, still, y'all haven't seen my mom yard. And we just have plenty of space for them to just play and run around and have fun and stuff like that. So, nope. I really don't have to pay for anything except the bills that I have here. So, you know, light bill. We won't have cable. So, Wi-Fi. Just a little normal bills. Um, so, yeah. Somebody else said something about why I did not stay in the apartment. And I said, dang, they must be new over here because they just, I, I can really, that, they come in right there through me. Why would I stay in the apartment and I could have a trailer that I could pay for and not have to worry about paying no mortgage or none of that stuff? Like, they don't make no sense to me, but that's the reason. Like, I don't want to have to have that debt on me. And, and another reason why is because I really did want to fix it real quick. I didn't want it to be so bad where I just, you know, get in over my head. But I feel like this trailer here is just enough. You know, it's right there tip, but it's just enough for me to kind of just like work around, work with it and, you know, do little updates and stuff like that. I think the kitchen will probably be my biggest update, my biggest home improvement project. So, I'm going to make sure that I have, like, all my funds together before I start that one. I'm going to make sure I have the person that's going to do it for me. Like, I want to make sure just everything is right before I even start. Because when I start, I want it to be done. I don't want them to start and stop and start and stop. So, kitchen not really that big. So, I don't really think it's going to take too, too much. But I want it to be nice and, you know, functional. So, yeah, I'm kind of excited. I can see the vision. And as long as I can see the vision, I'm happy. So, yeah, y'all. Um, this is December 8th. And we have 17 more days until Christmas. So, um, we, they're working on the lights, getting the lights on right now. Then they're going to be working on the water. So, once the lights come on, I'm going to try to come over here and carpet clean the floors and stuff. Somebody said, you know, get laminated, get laminated. I don't really, I really, um, I'm really thinking about going with the rug stuff that I got, which is this stuff. Uh, this is what I'm thinking about going with. Now, whatever I do, you know, it's going to be my decision. It's my darn house. So it's going to be my decision on what I want, but I want to see how it looks once he do put it down in the bathroom or whatever on top of the plywood, <laughs> not on top of mold. 
But uh, I want to see how it look when he puts it down. So once I see how it looks when he put it down, I go from there. Because, I mean, laminate is cool and all, but you know, laminate is high and then laminate is cold. If anybody have laminate, you already know how it is. In the trailer we was, we came from, no floors be so freaking cold, y'all. But um, I think rug is a little bit thicker and then just, I don't know. My mom have that at her house. And it don't be it don't be cold on her floor. So I like the fact that it don't be cold because I have a lot of kids, you know. So um and my and I myself don't really like to be on no cold floors either because I don't really like to wear socks throughout my house. Well I wear socks, you know, I wear house shoes really, but you know, when I don't wear my house shoes, I don't have to have socks on all the time, you know, walking through no cold house. So we're going to see about that. We're going to see. Once the time come and stuff like that, I'll see what I'll be going with. I want to do like the area with a wash and dry yet. I want to do something nice over there. I got it planned out of my head. I just got to bring it to life. I got a lot of plans, y'all. Y'all believe it. I got a lot of plans. So I just have to, you know, kind of pace myself, try not to get over my head and just um, work with it like that. All right, so now I got a call. I just want to kind of update y'all on that, and I'll be talking to y'all later. Say hey, everybody. What's Say hey. What's 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 Hi. Hey. Hi. You're so cute. Hi. Say what's up, H. Tell, Hi. It, tell everybody you dressed yourself today. H. W. My dad. Yeah. W. J. Got slime on it. Yeah, y'all want to see me? I got shot. Oh, he go uh the bathroom vanity cabinet that I was telling y'all about is put together now. Hey. And it closed on its own. It's not no slam door. So, see? yeah, just gotta give me some pull knobs and then the um top comb. Wednesday, I think. Wednesday, I think it's Wednesday. It's getting ready to rain out here, but we finna do something real quick. Rock, you wanna tell everybody hey? Go. Got my buddy with me. Look. <laughs> hey. Say hey, buddy. Open it, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we started the trailer this morning and got uh got my Alexa, got my plugs. I'm gonna get some um yeah my plugs and then I got the Febreze thingies. He said why you got the good stuff. I said she got a good stuff. Well, Rodney, you ain't, look at this thing. Look how empty it is. You ain't doing nothing with it. That's why I went on the guy down out there. It's a most still down there. I'm trying to get Rodney to put this up for me today, him. You know? This doorknob, if you don't mind. All right, so we got the light people here today. Hopefully they get the lights on. I decided that in our living room, we're gonna get a ceiling fan. So we're gonna change this light out. The light that we got up in there right now, which is that. It's coming out. It's gonna be a um, ceiling fan. Oh yeah, our TV's going on that wall. Couch going on the other wall. We're gonna be all set. We're gonna be trying to get up in this thing. Put our Christmas tree up so we can be in this thing. All right. So I went to the dollar store and I got some cleaning stuff. I got the um, I got the vacuum cleaner and the, and, and all that other stuff. I just gotta bring it in. I'm gonna show y'all what I got real quick from the store. We got some paper towels. We got some of this. Uh, I got some of this awesome daily shower. I usually use this in every part of anywhere I can use it. I love awesome products. And I just got some soap. So we got some Windex Clean. I got some of this Lysol. I put a whole lot of this. I think I put like three of these on the Amazon wish list. I like this and I like the um smell. It's brand new day. Then I just got some of this game detergent. I mean game um dishwashing liquid. Probably gonna use this to like clean out tubs and stuff like that with that daily um awesome clean on. That's what I used to clean it out with. Well one thing I didn't get was oh I don't have no microfiber cloth or no um Brillo pads. So I got a dang I'm gonna have to go back to the store. And I just got some of this crisp white um toothpaste.
All right, so the plans for today is to clean as much as I can. Roger's gonna try to get out water on, and then um, I guess they're gonna probably work on the getting the bathroom fixed. And depending on how much we get done today, we probably could start moving our stuff in tomorrow. I plan on cleaning a good bit today. If I can, if the twins let me do what I gotta do. But I gotta take Ava to a parade in an hour. So um, she's in a parade, so I gotta take her to a parade. What's the matter, man? What's the matter? Oh, I guess I'll be taking y'all along with us. Just a minute. I'm hoping that they go ahead and get the lights on. That's what we're waiting on to see. I got this baby super clean. Like you're walking through it. I cleaned it, cleaned it, cleaned it. Now I'm finna get ready to vacuum this floor so I can start trying to uh, deep clean it. Probably gonna deep clean it later, but I'm finna go ahead and start vacuuming. the pain 
Alright, this side's looking now that it's been vacuumed. You know what that big stain is right there? What you do with oven? Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, look at my spoon. Yep. Roger finna get ready to change our doorknob. Oh, then I've been stuck a key in the pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. 